Hey everybody, it's Liga Giraffe here with another episode of my Total well, Total War Attila Western Roman Empire campaign part six. Uh so last time you joined me, um a couple things were going on. Uh I did a lot of damage to the Franks affair, I actually forgot to start recording. What happened is I pretty much took this army that was uh here. I pretty much went and I counterattacked the Frankish army pretty much wipe them all out. So now this guy is hopefully going to be able to go up here, uh, raise this province to the ground, and hopefully the Franks will be no more. Then uh, they'll be able to return back uh, with one more border, slightly safer. Uh, what else? Um, oh yeah, I had a, a fairly hard, hard fought battle actually over uh, Macedonia, which I had then raised. However, I was kind of too weakened uh, by the by that battle, so I wasn't able to kind of pursue the Visigoths, I'm pretty sure, are hiding down around here. So that's a bit of a shame. Um, I've got these guys, who are hopefully going to attack the uh, Visigoths. And then I managed to retake Spain as well, with uh, this army here. So, if we end the turn, let's see what happens. Actually, check my family tree first. Yeah, everything looks good. Uh, okay, let's see what happens. Oh, some of the Viscots are down there. Burning and a pillage, and hopefully they attack Macedonia, that'd be amazing. <laughs> try get on the because actually in my Eastern Roman Empire I've managed to get pretty friendly with the Huns. I've got like a non-aggression pact signed and everything. So I might see if there's anyone they're currently at war with that I can declare war with to uh them. Oh my god they're finally attacking Eboricum. Wow this took them a long time. <laughs> Son of fighting against Britain and lots of fighting against the Jutes. Fun so much fun. <laughs> Can't even handle all the fun right now. That was actually quite cool. uh, Yeah, I can't I can't believe it's taken them this long to uh <laughs> to finally attempt to capture the settlement. Let's see how we can do. Let's see how many losses we can uh, we can cause the guys. Ugh, foggy again. Classic. So we've got the siege tower, and then we have the rest of them. Protectors Domestici. I'll stick these guys over here just to defend against those guys. Actually, maybe even be able to kill the general. That would be really amazing. As for the rest of the guys, I will. Defend the gate with my life. Three siege towers manned by archers. <laughs> That's great. So I'll stick these guys. 
right here, and then let's take these guys probably somewhere out of the way. I just spread them out here. Put them into loose formation. Keep those guys there. Keep my horses way back here. And then I swear to put my barricade. Hum, hum, hum. Uh, ooh, I think they're pretty good actually because I can retrieve my archers if necessary and kind of fire down from people there. So I'll put it there. Alrighty. Let's see how this goes. Actually, I forgot about all the reinforcements. <laughs> Nuts. Ah, oh well, at least they don't have any siege towers. We don't stand a chance. The enemy outnumbers us. Tower is broken. Oh, that might be because of the damage they've done. That has been on. Of course, the freaking broken ones are over here. Sigh. Yeah, I guess we'll keep going. That's oh, there's also a leftover siege tower over there. Jeez, they were doing this for a while. Luckily, the artillery is almost out of ammunition, so it should prove to be a problem for Slugger. Ah, not that compromised, to be fair here. Artillery's out of ammo. Perfect. They stop firing at the siege tower. The attitude of cavalry. It'll be more productive. I feel. Fire the cavalry! God damn it! Stupid archers. Uh, these guys know what they're doing yet. Doesn't look like it. should be made short work of by my cohorts heavy melee infantry. So this Palatina might prove to be a bit of an issue. Let's bring my guys over here, charge them from the rear.
<laughs> Getting absolutely destroyed. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh dear. God, they're still going. God damn it. God damn it. I don't know how pathing works in this game, but it's a little weird. Let's go and attack those guys right now. How are these guys fresh? They've been pushing a siege tower for like several hundred meters. Oh my god, they're still capturing that. Oh, jeez. Scouts over there. I want to get this over with quickly so I can move all these guys over there to try and do something that is ridiculous. Sigh. By the bell. Let's get that side charge in too. Ah, everything is fine. Actually, are they actually doing anything? Oh, there. <laughs> Very slowly. Leave them there. Everyone to attack these guys. Absolutely ridiculous. 
I mean, I think it's safe to say that I've lost this and it is a matter of time. But, you know, we're going to carry on. We're going to carry on. Let's see how, how, how I would do. I'm contrary. Absolutely wrecked. everything takes so long to die like these guys are taking ages these guys are taking absolutely ages mad absolutely mad These guys literally at the gates. No siege weapons though, which is a nice. They don't try to. Oh no, they have. Oh dear. That is really not good. Oh well. So that will kill their general eventually. Like, why is that still going down? Even though it shows my banner going up. Like, yeah. Don't even know. Don't even want to know. I just want to kill these stupid Palantina guards. Let me done with that. Let's just charge him straight in there. The safest bet is probably to hold up in there then. That's what I will probably end up doing. Hurrah! Finally. So I'll run these guys out actually and maybe... Yeah, I guess go and try to see if I can kill a skirmish unit or two with my horses. Might as well, you know. Oof, I got out of the way just in time. All that archer fire. Thank God these guys are finally wavering. <laughs> God, I hate fighting against the Romans so much. Ah, oh, jeez. Terror, fight for contrary. This guy's still not dead yet. Only they lost. Well, they actually lost quite a few. I'm pretty pleased with that, I suppose. Oh my god, this is absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I don't know how they take so long to die. The 
keep them there anyway. Alright, just getting the crap beaten out of them by Spearman. And yeah, there they go. Nice and snug. Advance at speed. The at speed. There we go. Okay, that's a bit weird. Ah, finally. General. Wow. Go. Okay, scouts. Scouts, scouts, scouts. Let's have them chill out here for a while. See what's what. Ah, well, that's a relief. Anyway. Now, and I. And you guys over here. Sorry, tactical view there. Uh, so yeah, my next step is pretty much I have my own units. Go pretty much bring my units. Everyone over there, hold up in there, and pretty much just wait for them to attack me and just see how many I can kill before they eventually just want me down with sheer force of numbers. Just actually seeing if I can get these guys here in time. This guy's into the studio. Didn't realize a unit had run away. <laughs> Still though, getting some good damage. Oof, nearly 2,000 men destroyed. That's great. I guess I will run these guys into these dudes, and hopefully they won't hold me up too long. But knowing, ah uh, no, knowing this battle, they're going to take up to the ages break. So I'm not holding up any hope. Very slow battle. better if all my towers were still there. Like these guys are doing great work. Like, look at that. Like, they are the man of the match, no doubt. Hopefully going to cause the, uh, the Jutes some nice, tasty uh, casualties, I guess, if nothing else. So I'm going to bring these guys out of retirement. All fresh now and running into the back of these guys. Hopefully, cause some sort of a route. Probably be the best thing. Let's see, yes, that's what to do with these guys. I guess. We're gonna actually these guys just kind of stayed over here. Actually, ooh, that's what I might try to do actually, though. Uh, it might be a little far gone. If I, could, if I could hold these two towers here, I could foresee them doing quite a bit of damage. Anyway, here come my heavy infantry. To run against their Nordic levy. Take that levy. for a second. Uh, yeah, okay, it doesn't look like they're attacking the gates or anything, so I am actually just going to chill out. guys around here and then attack these guys. 
I really like that feature actually that they brought in Taylor where you can kind of just queue up stuff like that. It's really useful. You know, the funny thing is, if they if the AI continued to be so stupid, I might actually have a chance at winning this. As ridiculous as that sounds. Guys, absolute, absolute beasts. I must, uh, I must get, I must get some of them into my armies. Again, ah, oh, these towers. You know, putting in, putting in a lot of good work. Oh, sure, are they going to start breaking them down? Off pretty sharpish. I probably will lose because I won't be able to hold off that many as much as I would like to. Back up here in time for a last stand esque rigmarole. Also, these Nordic Levy are really persistent. <laughs> Towers. Wow. Uh, I should get there just in time. Okay. It was just bulk up right there <laughs> and make myself a right nuisance. Let's see if I can actually scroll thrall skirmishers as well. Try to do something useful. So I can hold off for what, 15 more minutes, you know? Oof. Chance I could do something wrong. Come on, hurry up. <laughs> Run faster. Well, um, oh man, <laughs> uh, that is not good. Okay, these guys. Alright, I will just fast forward now and see how long I can last. 
Cheer, Test of Will. <laughs> Individual uh, infantry doing a kick ass job there. Like a poster boy to soak up, uh, soak up fire. Slowly. <laughs> God, so much, so much, so many skirmishers. That is ridiculous. The barricades are under attack. Right. Death by a thousand cuts, definitely. charge that I would just get absolutely melted away. No doubt about it. Ah oh, jeez. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Plus side, wow, like that is really impressive. They have 1,500 men out of 5,000. I've I've almost killed what, three and a half thousand men. They've lost in trying to take this place. That is really impressive. And now, actually, well, if I can somehow last eight more minutes, I will win, or at the very least, I'll, I'll draw, should I say? Which I think would be a great victory. Yeah, so they're all fresh, they're all shaken. Well, these two guys aren't, because they're cool. Their spirits are shaken. <laughs> they're slowly running out of ammunition. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. Do I wonder? I'm not a hundred percent sure. They will last, you know, crap, there's one. Five, six minutes to go. Can my trusty cohorts hold on? There's a sheer, incredible amount of archery, f archery fire. Okay, no, so I do lose then. Oh, oh well. Still, that was 
really impressive. I'm very pleased with that. <laughs> uh, destro totally destroyed the British army. And the Gale army has been reduced to what? Half strength. So a big credit there went to the cohorts. Yeah, the cohorts there and the spearmen. What's going on with the cohorts and the, uh, the explorators? That was really, really good. 34 minutes long, Jesus Christ. <laughs> the Siege of Eboricum. Not even didn't even take it, jeez. Okay, the rebels have taken it, fine. Good. Kill the battle, let me kill the battle, something sacked. Syria was under siege. God damn you find a plague. To in Africa. Upon us to cult the god for the lands to deserve equal rights. Hmm, give them equal rights. Or impose sanctions. I'm going to impose sanctions. Because I'm mean like that. Who is Syrian under siege by? Ah. The filthy Illyrians. Which of course are made up of elite Roman soldiers. Yeah. Twelve units. Uh, put my phone on silent. Ah, alrighty. Okay, my turn. What to do? What to do? Let's see, so we've got raiding going on somehow. Finally defeat, uh, buildings constructed, that's great. Food George there, poet gained. And then, ooh, rank gained for looks like all of my um, all of my governors, which is super. Can never have enough governors. Stamp out corruption as best I can. Because it is a plague upon this fair city. As you can see, as I'm doing that, my income is literally increasing. So I'm stamping out all the filthy 75% corruption. That's absolutely ridiculous. And I got I got 400 400 extra gold there just by just from that guy stamping out corruption in his in his in his province. Mad, like absolutely mad. Okay. Uh, ooh, gonna put a reservoir there because that's all pretty dirty in my mind. Okay. Uh, this guy. Gonna head straight onto Flevum, which is hopefully unprotected and an easy target. Almost, yeah. Almost. None will escape. Okay, we got two sword guys. Cool. I don't know how that's so equal, so I'm just going to do this manually because I don't want to lose a whole bunch of guys. I don't really have the time for it, to be honest. Great name. 
colors, you're so, you're so funny. Oh, what that name and all. It's like, uh, shut up, guys. I get that, I get that a lot. Fog. Dry. Almost like, almost like being dry, you know. Because I'm just that kind of person. Dry. <laughs> okay, cool. First things first. Set up my artillery. Sub in. What I'm hoping will be a defensive formation because what is going on here? Oh, it's a massive rock. <laughs> That's good though. Can you set as a little tool to guard the section there. So let's see, send these guys over here and then do the same for these dudes. Keep them nice and safe. Alrighty. Let's get ready to remove. Actually, die. No. Mm. Where am I going to be coming from now? I wonder. Do, 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 do. Get them over here. Shoot these guys to death. Master, damn you. going on with my ridiculous skirmishers who I love and cherish. This guy's up in the defense of Testudo. Oh, is that some of our current? Just what I wanted to do. Ah. Beautiful. <laughs> Just beautiful. These guys back up here, so they go around the side. That direction.
side. Ah, beautiful. Just beautiful, look at that. Archers. We have gained the upper hand. The tower has been destroyed. This <laughs> Excellent. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ah, oh, brilliant, brilliant shot. Look at that. Absolutely fabulous. Over here, I get these guys, I guess, to unload the last of their stuff into these guys and then run away. are very slowly coming over to us so I think now what needs to happen these guys need to get destroyed and to somebody to capture that tower Rent. so what I'll do is how do you capture ah that's a pain in the ass Thirty minutes to kill three hundred and eighty nine men. Formation. Well, they're stopped to charge into that. Ah. Brilliant. And that's how you defeat a shock charge.
Okay, so I'm trying to get I'm going to go rid of this tower then, so it'll stop firing at me. Hopefully then try and surround these guys. As best I can. Cause them to break. Torch power! Ah, oh, brilliant. I do love the pillum. Oh, Trunk spurs are just so effective, they really are. Oh yeah, look at that. Destruction. So I guess we'll come back here and wait for uh, our last guy to make an appearance somewhere. I'll wait a little while, then he goes and appear. I guess I'll just march in, take this tower, and just wait here for him. But hopefully he'll come out and save me the bother. No, there he is. Speed things up a little. Oh god, is he actually walking towards us? Oh man, he is. Uh, please, just waste more of my time. damage down there. Some really good damage down actually, wow. <laughs> General, there he goes, and there is my victory. Awesome. I am going to raise this place to the ground. And then I think, I think that could well be the Franks faction destroyed. I think. As far as I know, yeah, as far as I know, they only had a single province, and I destroyed both of their armies. I think that'll be him gone now. Hopefully it will be. That'd be nice. Attack and then occupy. Hmm. That's a good point. 
I don't actually know. I don't know. Can I sack and then race? Because I get more money. Ah, oh, well. I'll just race for now. Commander. Commander. So I don't need to deal with their shit. That's what you get for attacking the Romans. That's pretty cool though, the way it does that. Oh, bit of a weird thing went on there. Yeah, cool, moving back to the capital. Western Roman rebels. <laughs> right, okay, cool, so that's done. This guy, he needs to get over to Africa because there is a rebellion cooking. Captives, faction, politics, blah 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 blah. Okay, then this guy. What to do with this guy? What I will do is I'll take him what off that, of head him over here, get him to stay here for a turn just to you know, get some more guys up and then that attack. I am There's the Roxelanians. Leave him there for now. Uh, then we have Stilico. Where did they go? That is where they went. Ready for battle. Game. To victory! Ah, god damn it! Oh well. Victory! At least they will take some casualties because they're in the snow. So that's fine. Capital. Okay, that's armies. Next, this awful case of uh, immigrants. Ugh. It's awful case of a uh, public order because like I could build amphitheaters and like they actually oh you know they just uh just cause food oh I thought they had to get, they had a maintenance upkeep oh, okay so next then I might just make them but then. I guess, yeah, you get a little bit of culture and stuff, but it's not great. 14 dash, like, minus 1, that's fine. Minus 5 is a bit bad. Like, once I do that, like, that's my entire kind of... That's my entire thing gone, to be honest. But it would fix it, though. Let's make... Let's get my most... Popular ones like that's happy. That's happy well, for now. <laughs> that's happy, and that's happy. So uh, next, Betica. All right, fair enough. It's not that happy. I'll get that sorted. Actually, once I got a mutiny, five turns, so I should just get there in time. It's fine. I'll build out there, and then. I'll leave that alone because that might push it over the edge into rebellion sooner than I want, so I'll kind of hold off on that. So minus one, yeah, that's fine. Terraconsis, minus five. I'm looking to see if I can build some uh, guard towers, but I can't. Africa. Uh, where's Constantinia? Atratum. Yeah, I might build one in Hatcherton then. Just build a guardhouse. Uh, okay, cool. And then that's my money gone for the uh, for the turn. Good stuff. Okay, so that's done. Um, I was thinking as well. Actually, this guy doesn't have much influence left. But I was thinking about possibly adopting someone just because I kind of need more. Family tree people. Yeah, I could plot to diminish some. Because then, what? 
go from acceptable to weak. Uh, that's not the worst thing, but then loyalty kind of goes away, yeah. Push their influence, or secure loyalty, or assassinate. Quintus Aurelius Smechius. Yeah, ah well, I might just leave it for now. Keep gathering influence until I need to use it. So that's fine, then how many different diplomacy wise? Elements. Come, come, let me hear your talk. I would be cool if we could, like. Wow, well, those gems a lot of, worth a lot of money. I, well, I basically just like stuck him too, so I need to wait for him to attack, defeat him, and then go and like. Ah, oh, the Franks do still exist, actually. I don't see that over there. It's fine though. Um, area, Armenia, to do, to do, to do. Britain. Greetings in the name of the. Really want to try for a peace treaty with you guys. I wonder how much I need to offer them. Don't have, don't have, don't have that kind of money right now. You have the peace ear treaty. No. Eastern Roman Empire. My, 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 my dudes, how we doing? The gods bless us with your presence today. I will doubtless find pleasure in your wisdom here. Uh, declare war, state, military alliance. Payments. Yay, cool. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> you have the ear of my people. Uh, Franks. You have the ear of my people. Still want to accept peace treaty. Gotta admire, uh, gotta Great admire that. Most excellent friend. Be Nice. Get me some of them payments. The pleasures of my household. Geats. I have little gain in wasting the day on you. Go to you. What you say? Nope. Nothing from them. Uh, how about the Gassanids? My friend, you honor the. Thanks, bro. The Huns. Please don't bother with meaningless pleasantries. Talk of meat, not honey. So does my ass join against the Gru Gruinthians? Moderate. Huh. Where are the Gruinthians? Oh, undiscovered. Might do that then. Let's see if I can bolt anything else onto this. They actually don't even want. They, they don't even want her. For the good of. Oh, so they're there. Cool. So that'll hopefully make them a little happier towards me because I do. I do want to try to get them on my good side just because they get they get so ridiculously strong. <laughs> the gods will have me listen to you. Enter your territory. Do not speak words without merit. Oh, okay, so I could gift them a region. Interesting. Very interesting. Do not attempt to sweeten. Nope. Please that's accept good. as the most humble or hey, that's good. Lugians. I have little gain in wasting the day. No. Macedonia. Speak quickly. Here, Merkamans. I am sure you have many pleasantries. Uh -uh. Before you say anything, know that I have. Orions. My master extends the most. <laughs> I have so few friends. <laughs> Speak quickly. Oh and dear. Well. Those darn Aquadians. Come, come. Let me hear your talk. I warn you. I have no stomach for the meat or nice. Please don't bother with meaningless pleasantries. Assassinates Saxons. I have little gain in wasting the day. So no, and then the Visigoths. Do not attempt to sweeten. 
Actually, I don't even know why I opened that. I, I want to just destroy those guys so bad. Actually, let me check down here. Those Morians. I swear, if they recolonize that, I'm going to get so mad. <laughs> ah, right. Ah, so, so I got an extra 2,000 from all that sleuthing. That's pretty nice. Uh, Aquatana. See, I won't be able to build any happy things. So I might try and just upgrade. So I've got some field there. That's fine. Don't need them right now. I've got plenty of food. Okay. Seven. God, that's pretty heavy, actually. It's uh, disease. Okay, I want to upgrade that then to a future caster. Actually, I already have a dope jar. I'll leave that one alone. Fine. And oh, Italia. Italia. Vedega, no. Aquitana, no. Uh, Terraconsis, no. Africa, no. Arbonsis is extremely happy, actually. Why is it so happy? Buildings give it 17 happiness. Ah, vineyard. Nice. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna uh, build a workshop here then. Actually, a good place to do it. And where's Sisica? Oh, where's Sisica? And then Domavia as well. Charlie has a guardhouse. That's cool. I'm gonna build a workshop here as well. Okay, cool. Awesome. They will do me very nicely. And I think that is a good place to end the video. So, as always, thanks for watching, guys. It was a pleasure. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye bye.